Boffins in the kitchen are very scientific. <gasps> it's dissolving, Aristotle. And now it's changing colour. They're always asking questions, both general and specific. What does the book say? Oh, uh, perhaps a few more drops. Uh, what for? Well, I've just received a letter from my sister Doris, and I'd like to ring her up. Oh, well, does she have a telephone? Um, does it, um... No. Uh -huh. Well, that settles it then. Oh, but we're so cut off here. Nobody well, ever rings us up. Yes, but that's because we don't have a telephone. <laughs> oh, good. So you agree? We do what? need one. You get the telephone, and I'll find a place to put it. Oh, oh dear. Where in the kitchen am I going to find a telephone? Da <laughs> yoo -hoo, oh, Hey, what are you doing? Oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Yes. Um, what are you doing? Oh. I, I, I'm being scientific. You don't look like you were being very scientific. Oh. You were snoozing. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was not snoozing. I, I, I was thinking, you see. <laughs> Madame Curie wants me to find her a telephone, but I can't find one anywhere in the kitchen. Oh. I can fix that. What? You can? How? Echo, you go stand over there. What? Oh, come here. Oh, oh. Uh -huh. oh, oh right. <laughs> and I'll go stand over here. Right. Uh, and? Hello. 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 Oh. See? A telephone. We spoke to each other over a long distance. <laughs> oh, really? You buffered. Oh, sorry, yes. Aristotle. It was Newton's idea. Me? But when we shouted out, I did think I heard something rather odd. You did? Listen. Like what? Mm. Hello? 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 <laughs> Amazing. Oh, you have a go, Newton. Me? Great. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, yeah. <laughs> An experiment! An experiment! An experiment? Ah! Oh, it's... it's Madame Curie. Yes. Oh, I, I thought you were an echo. Uh, Aristotle, I'm echo. Mm. No, no, not you, echo. An echo. Um, echo. Huh? But who's an echo? Oh, yeah. no, no, not an echo. A sound that bounces back. Uh, back. Hmm? Aristotle. Yes? Haven't you told them yet about the sound waves? Uh, I, I, will, I was just getting to that. Oh. Uh, uh, what about sound waves? Oh, I'm hmm. glad you asked. Follow me. Right. Hello. 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 When you open up your mouth to say a simple word or two, woo, it shakes up all the gases oh, in the yeah. air surrounding you. A sound wave ripples outward throughout the atmosphere till it strikes oh. another boffin <laughs> and ends up in, in your, your ear. ear. 
Now to find that sound is a sound wave, uh -huh. try a small experiment. <laughs> Stand away from something solid, like a wall made of cement. Yell out something loudly, loudly. and out the sound will track. It bounces off the solid wall, and you'll get an echo back. back. Oh. Hello. 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 Sound waves speed through water, and most solid objects do. Place your ear near any object. You'll hear sound, sound waves sneaking through. through. You can hear a perfect sound wave when I pluck a nice tight line. Yes, we hear the sound wave, and we think it sounds quite fine. Ah, simply spiffling! What? what? I think I've discovered a way to make a telephone. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like another echo. Oh. <laughs> well, I finished. Yep, OK. I finished too. Then the telephone is complete. Oh. It's quite a simple machine, really. Mm -hmm. As you speak into this tin, the sound waves travel up the clothesline and you can hear them in this tin. I see. But does it really work? Oh, Madame Curie. Oh, oh. <laughs> tin. Hello? Hello? Oh, this is Madame Curie. Can you hear me? This is Newton. Can you hear me? It works! It works. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yes! It's brilliant! My telephone is a complete success! <laughs> oh, yes. I know. Oh, I know. Oh, yes, yes, I know just what you mean. Well, Aristotle, funnily enough, is exactly like that. Oh, yes, yes, he does it to me all the time. I remember. Huh? Yes, oh, I know. Dear. <laughs> what in the kitchen was he doing that for? <laughs> Madame Curie's been on the telephone for hours. I wonder who she's talking to. Oh. Well, mm. it's been lovely talking to you. All right, then, dear. Bye-bye. Mm. Madame Curie, who was that you were talking to on the telephone? I have no idea. What? I think it was a wrong number. God. But uh, I had a lovely conversation all the same. Oh! Madame Curie? Oh. <laughs> Aristotle? Directory assistance, please. Hello. Hello. Yes. Hello. When you open up your mouth to say a simple word or two, woo, it shakes up all the gases oh, in the air surrounding you. A sound wave ripples outward throughout the atmosphere till it strikes oh. another boffin. <laughs> And ends up in your ear. Hello. Hello. Sound waves speed through water, and most solid objects do. Place your ear near any object. You'll hear sound waves sneaking through. You can hear a perfect sound wave when I pluck a nice tight line. Yes, we hear the sound wave, and we think it sounds quite fine. 